On the Bank, proudly sponsored by Clearwater Fisheries. Angling in the Northwest. Welcome back to the show. A little bit more about Bow Beach later on. Now, I know the two of us clown around a little bit, but one of the things about fishing is there is a very serious side. Husey has been to see a fantastic charity called Second Chance and the great work they do. Angling is a very benevolent pastime. It can be whatever you want it to be. If you want to compete, compete. Alternatively, if you want to sit in beautiful countryside, enjoying nature on your own, then do that as well. But I'm here today to meet a group of people who are using angling for a very, very different purpose. This is a really, really important area of social work and it's having some fantastic effects. <music> Second Chance is a, an innovative social working agency that started uh, 35 years ago uh, in the west of London and we discovered that taking the kids fishing had uh, quite, a, quite an effect on the youngsters. Just taking them fishing wasn't enough because we just kind of raised their expectations and then left them in limbo so we set up a whole sort of structure to support them in their lives to give them a second chance or a second bite at, uh, uh, at life because life hasn't uh, dealt them too good a, a deal. We've got children that come from dysfunctional families mainly. They're all in the city kids. Some of them have learning difficulties. A few of them have behavioural disorders and such like, but they, uh, they've all fallen through the net really. They've been referred to us by social services and special schools and they're, they're in need of um, some support. Otherwise they're gonna just drop off the radar completely but we're looking to sort of change the direction that their lives are taking. The really great thing is, of course, because in their own eyes, a lot of them consider themselves to be failures because they've, um, uh, they've been chucked out of one school or another. To introduce a bit of success into their lives can often be transformational. For some of them, it might be the very first time that they've, they've felt that feeling of doing something well. So to catch a fish and to put it on the bank and have their photographs taken and, and for us all to admire the, the fish and the quality and the skill that's been uh, exhibited in catching it and things can make a big difference to, it, to a young person's life. Sean, the senior youth worker with me at the moment. Oh, we've got toots behind us going on there. Um, <laughs> the boys seem to really enjoy this. Yeah. They get a lot from it. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, I mean, a lot of them, they come from council estates or inner city life. So when they come out here, it's totally different to what they're used to. And I think it gives them a sense of kind of a little bit of freedom, a little bit of something they're not used to, you know, puts them in a bit of a strange situation, really. Yeah. What's it like working with these kids? Great. I mean, they're brilliant. I can relate a lot to them. I came from a similar background to them. Um, what they're going through, the things they're going through as well. So yes, it's brilliant to work with them. So how effective do you think fishing is? Um, I think it, it's really effective. I mean, it's, it gives a sense of achievement. I mean, for a lot of these kids, they don't ever achieve anything. Or if not, they're, they're told they're never going to achieve anything. And the minute they're catching a fish, it's that sense of, I can do it, I've achieved something here. So I think it's brilliant. I think it's absolutely brilliant. Yeah. Fantastic. Lots of smiley faces. Yeah, yeah, they're loving it. Yeah. These two down here in particular, they're, they're great. Yeah. They've done very well today they're already good. so they're, far. They're, you know, they are usually the ones that catch the most anyway, yeah, yeah. Got Alfie and Reggie with me now, and uh, they're a bit dab hands at this angling. Um, you enjoy it down here then? Yeah, um, when I got pulled out of school, uh, I started coming here every Tuesday and started fishing and it just gave me an excuse almost to get out and something to look forward to instead of just being sat indoors. Excellent. And you fished before then? Uh, a little bit, but not very well. What do you like about it? What's the best bit? I think just the buzz of catching, especially when you catch a big fish, the buzz of it is just amazing. Excellent. Fantastic news. And you're fairly new down there as well, aren't you? You like horses, you like the countryside by the look of you. Yeah. Have you been fishing before? I'm inside fishing when I come here. Okay. Have you caught anything yet? Mm. Yeah. 
Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. What do you like about it? Don't know. Don't know, but he likes it. You know what? I feel like that. I feel like that sometimes. Being out in the countryside, you don't know why you like it, but you just like it. We've got Louis Worthington with us now, and Louis, you've been through this program. Uh, just tell us a little bit about it and how it's helped you. Uh, well, like I said, it helped uh, with my experience of fishing. Um, my life obviously was at a bad stage when I was younger, so. So it's an experience. That's, I've never experienced doing fishing before. Do you know what I mean, no one's had the time to take me to go fishing until I come the second chance. Teachers used to say it to me like, "You're not going to do not well. You're going to end up in prison if I carry on the way I was." So I had hard bringing up in my life, and they were there to help me through it. Well, it's action stations down here, and it was a rod we put down on the right-hand side, and it's just rattled off really, really quickly. This is the way we like to see it. Right, you're going on the nets this time, aren't you, young man? This is the place to be. This is. Uh... This is where all the carp are being caught at the moment. Right, remember what he did for you last time. You're going to do that again, but we don't go in there yet. Get your net down. Keep it out of the way. Oh. We've got the fish in the area now. No panic now. Well, I don't know about these boys, but I've had an absolutely fantastic day. Now, have we got some smiling faces? Yeah. Have we enjoyed fishing? What do we think about it? Three, two, one. Yay! It was a really moving day. Yeah. You know, really, really moving day to see those kids. You know, they've had tough times. Yeah. They've had really, really tough times, some of them. And it's lovely to see the smiles on the faces. Yeah. Uh, you know, the, some of them are naughty lads. Some of them just had trouble times. But fishing does pull people back on track. It condenses that thought it's process, exactly doesn't it? Exactly what you... Yeah, I was just going to say the same thing because you never know what people need no. um, and, and those those people that have created that charity giving those lads opportunities to experience what you and I kind of take for granted a little bit I mean we've both been fishing for years and years I know what it does for me yeah. but f for them to have the opportunity is a magnificent thing and I bet you it's made a huge difference in their lives massively well you've only got to look at the guy that's actually been through the program gone back has got his life back yeah. on track again and is helping out Wonderful. there it's fantastic and you know all of the guys there behind the scenes they do an incredible job lovely venue too, and isn't it? Brilliant. It, it is it's it's um what can you say about it it's got all sorts of things you know it teaches the kids about animals it teaches them about wildlife about husbandry uh, and the fishing is the hook for want of a better word to pull them in and just get them back on the straight and narrow again and it is absolutely fantastic well done guys you brilliant. get the thumbs up from us brilliant brilliant work anyway coming up after the break it's back to bow beach for a little bit more on the feeder international on the bank proudly sponsored by clearwater fisheries Angling in the Northwest. <laughs> 